I'd just like to go over some of the points from that Blue Dragon video because I was like not articulating myself very well and I was like trying to like talk fast and couldn't get all my ideas out very nicely. So yeah, that the, on the forum they were saying if I wanted to like promote web comics to make my own website, which pay for this, pay for that, pay for someone to do this, pay for someone to do that, it's just bullshit, right? Just it's fucking it's fucking stupid. And uh, basically, the their solution was like, go hide all these web comics on the deepest, darkest corner of the internet that nobody will ever see. And, you know, it's it's infuriating and it pisses me off. And what's fucking insane is like, motherfucker, you are making comics. Like, do you do you want people to read your comics or not? Because <laughs> like if if you don't want anybody to read your comics, that's fine. But like I'm making this shit because I wanted to get out there. You know, I want my ideas to be out there and I want to build upon them and I want to do crazy stuff. Like I want to make games off of them. And a lot of people, you know, they're and goal is something like uh, having like an anime adaptation or something. So how, how is that going to benefit anybody hiding it somewhere that nobody's ever going to see it? So my whole angle is like, where are all the people? So I try going on a lot of forums to promote, but it's like all forums are basically dying. So the thing is, Comic Fury is pretty much the biggest and best place out there right now. So the other places is basically like the major social media platforms. And my idea was like, let's just start something. Let's start some kind of like franchise across all social media. And all we do is like promote our web comics, not just our web comics, people doing it, you know, all the web comics, all the web comics that we like, even the web comics that we don't fucking like, because I do that too, because you know, I, there's comics that I don't like and I tell people, you know, I think this is trash. I think this is garbage, but that doesn't mean, you know, nobody in the world is going to like it. No matter how whack a comic is, there's hundreds of people who's, who's, who are going to read that. But how are we going to get it out to those people? That's the thing. And that's what I want people to focus on. And I know we can do it, you know, it just, it just takes some effort and it takes you using your brain a little bit. You know, just relying on what's there. Or trying to like start your own website that how the fuck is anybody going to know that website exists? Like that's the whole problem is people don't know these comics exist. So we got to get out to where the people are and we got to show them these comics. That's the thing. And it's the, the key audience. Like who are the people that are going to want to read it? You don't want to show it to people that are going to hate it. You want to show it to the people that are going to want to read it. And believe me, like all the comics that I, I show, even if I if, if it's not my thing, I don't like the story, I don't like the art style, you know, that's just me. I know that there are hundreds of people out there. I believe it 100% that there's people who are going to want to read those comics. And that's why I do that. That's why I promote it. Because I know there are people who will find value in it and appreciate it. And that's the people we have to go after. So that's going to be different for every comic, right? But, I mean, I think there's something pretty simple we could do. So imagine it was like someone on Facebook, on Twitter, on Instagram, or whatever whatever people are using. And you just have kind of like a webcomic review thing. But it could be like the same name across all these platforms, you know what I'm saying? And then all you do is like every day, you just promote these comics there. Then you use your hashtags. And then you're reaching an audience who otherwise would have never seen those comics. That that's the, that's the key, that's the whole point, right? And on the forum on Comic Fury, people are saying, everybody already knows comics exist. Everybody who wants to read them is already reading them. And that's just fucking bullshit, bro. Okay, like there's a lot of people think everyone else in the world thinks like they do and knows everything that they know, but it's not like that. So there are like millions of people in the world who would want to be reading these comics. They just do not know that they exist. Okay, that's the problem. And we like, it's all about just getting out to those people who appreciate it and would want to read it. So I just wanted to like really clarify those points and hopefully you guys get some ideas of like how we can do this because I believe we can, we can do it.